It is here, and uh, as Amanda mentioned, the weather looking better. It was a complete mud bath last year. Couldn't be much worse. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of dry weather. There is the risk of the odd sharp shower tomorrow, though, and that goes uh, for right across uh, Yorkshire tomorrow. So Sunday, the more reliably warm, dry and fine day of the weekend. Uh, so this afternoon, uh, sunny spells, a bit more cloud than this morning, and there will be the odd shower about, but for most places, it does look dry. And then uh, a few showers tomorrow, high pressure building in for Sunday, and actually for the early part of next week as well a good deal of dry and fine weather uh, with some sunshine and feeling warm as well uh, so this was the satellite picture earlier we had really nicely broken cloud uh, through this morning we've seen a bit more cloud develop for the afternoon um, and, and there is the small risk that that cloud could be thick enough for the odd shower but for most places it does look dry with yes more cloud but there'll still be some bright or sunny spells and temperatures will reach around uh, 20 or 21 degrees 21 is 70 Fahrenheit so the shower's dying away this evening, the cloud will melt away too and for most of the night it looks dry uh, and it uh, looks like it'll be fine and settle. A bit more cloud spreading into western parts later uh, in the night and temperatures falling back to around 10 or 11 degrees. So tomorrow a fine start in the east, we've got a thicker cloud in the west. This cloud will tend to thin and break and then cloud will just generally tend to develop along with a scattering of showers. They could be fairly widespread in places for the middle part of the day, becoming a bit more hit and miss as the afternoon goes on with some sunshine in between those showers as well. A light breeze and like today temperatures reaching uh, around 19 or 20 degrees. It might be a little bit fresher uh, through tomorrow. And then on Sunday it looks warmer again, dry and fine with some good spells of sunshine. Fine weather continuing into the early part of next week as well. Well, Dave. Looks pretty good. Thank you very much. And it's been a pretty decent day today. Sunday looks like the better day of the weekend. I'll be back at the end of the programme with all the details and a look ahead into next week. Is coming into the Weather Watchers page and we're also on social media as well. And I suspect there'll be lots of pictures to come over the next few days because we have got some pleasant weather to come, particularly from Sunday onwards. Sunday onwards, it looks like it's going to be dry and fine with a good deal of sunshine and into the early part of next week as well. Tomorrow for the Tramlines Festival, take your cagoule, take your brolly uh, if it's cool enough to do so because there could be uh, one or two sharp showers around. And that's really the case right across Yorkshire and North Derbyshire. We've got some spells of sunshine through tomorrow, but a scattering of showers as well. Uh, and the showers could be uh, heavy and and thundery. I think they'll be most widespread around the middle part of the day and then they'll tend to become a bit more hit and miss uh, through the afternoon. Uh, so uh, high pressure trying to build in. We'll have uh, a little feature bringing those showers tomorrow and then a ridge of high pressure on Sunday. That high pressure pushes in and establishes itself for a short while for Monday and Tuesday at least uh, with temperatures in the, the, the low 20s getting up to 23 or 24 degrees. And uh, then it looks like we'll have a bit of a breakdown into uh, Wednesday uh, with some showers or longer spells of rain. But we could well keep the temperatures. So uh, we had more cloud this afternoon compared uh, with this morning. But I think if anything, now we're losing the heat of the day, we'll start to see any showers fading away there's not been very many of them but any showers fading away the cloud will melt away and it'll be fine for most of the night later in the night a bit more cloud spreading in to western and northern parts but most places starting tomorrow morning with some sunshine temperatures down to around nine or ten degrees let's have a quick look at those high water times then at nine minutes past nine in scarborough and at just before half past nine in bridlington so most of us will start the weekend with some sunshine uh, the cloud will bubble up we will see sunshine developing you can see a scattering of showers quite widespread i think around the middle part of the day becoming a bit more hit and miss as the afternoon wears on there'll be some sunshine in between those showers and just a light breeze one or two of those showers could be heavy there could even be the odd rumble of thunder and temperatures perhaps a, a touch cooler than today but still getting up to around 18 or 19 degrees into tomorrow evening then again as we lose the heat of the day I think we'll lose those showers we'll see a little bit more in the way of sunshine tomorrow evening really could develop into uh, quite pleasant with plenty of sunshine and then as we move into Sunday it's going to be a fine night into Sunday Sunday itself There'll be plenty of sunshine to start the day. I suspect through the day we'll see some patchy cloud developing, but further spells of sunshine and it does look dry. And it will feel warm as well, with temperatures reaching around 24 degrees. High pressure dominates into the early part of next week, fine and dry, with some spells of sunshine. From about Wednesday onwards, we will start to see low pressure starting to take over, remaining warm, but with the risk of showers. Amanda.
Hello there, good evening. Sunday, the better of the two days over the weekend. Uh, tomorrow, there'll be some sunshine, but there'll also be a scattering of showers, and some of those showers could be heavy and thundery. And then Sunday and into the early part of next week, uh, high pressure dominating, so a lot of dry, settled and warm weather to come. Overnight tonight then there'll be some clear spells, it'll be a quiet settled night, a bit more clouds spreading into western and northern areas later in the night and temperatures will fall back to around 10 degrees. So many of us getting off to a bright start with some sunshine but cloud will develop, it'll bubble up and then through the course of the morning and into the afternoon we'll see a scattering of showers, some of them heavy and thundery, some places avoiding them and as we head through the afternoon they'll become a little bit more hit and miss, a little bit more sunshine making its way through, temperatures lifting to around 19 or 20 degrees. And then looking further ahead into tomorrow evening, we'll see those showers fading away, the cloud melting away too, and that'll set us up for a fine day on Sunday, dry and bright with some spells of sunshine and feeling warmer.